Hey Internet, how's it going? Welcome to another episode of the John Graves Show. Today I'm talking to everybody about Asterisk War Episode 3. And in terms of what happened in Episode 3 compared to what happened in the last episode, well, of course, Ayato goes goes to see Claudia. She tells him about the specific job of, you know, hanging of hanging around Julius because apparently somebody's out there targeting her. And of course, as we both already know, or at least as we all know, is that Ayato pretty much takes on the job. And of course, they do, uh, and of course, he does hang out with Julius. They have a wonderful time and everything. However, the problem with that is, though, is that she does get attacked again. And of course, Ayato, he does fight off everybody else because apparently Lester, him and his people, they do come over and then they act as, then they act up like, like, like fools again. And then as they're doing that, then that's when the guys in the black cloaks come up and then they try to attack him again. In the process of this, they do chase the, um, Ayato and Julius, they do chase the people in the black cloaks out, out, out into the forest. And of course, Ayato uses like his magical swordsman skills to pretty much stop all the attacks that, that, um, comes his way. And of course, you know, that does lead into, um, uh, any enemies they do get away, which, which like that does sort of lead them into, that does lead them into a fun little part of of them actually having like a moment with one another of them you know breaking down the walls of friendship and or at least or pretty much at least like you know breaking all those barriers in which that in which that Julius has around herself and of course she does tell she tells Ayato the reason why she came to the school is because she's doing it to because because she's doing it to to win money for this orphanage because because the people there they didn't see her as a princess they saw her as a regular person and they would and she had and she made all these friends there and they're like okay fine it's cool you can come on down and do whatever and she pretty much wanted to give them some funds because the because the kingdom in which that like she lives at they don't want to donate money to them so she's like fuck it I'll find uh, I'll find my own way to, to like give them money so of course but in the process of this though. Next day, she gets a duel from a specific somebody, one of Lester's men, to pretty much go on out and meet one of, uh, meet and to meet face to face, and then whatever happens there, you know, it's like, oh, okay, we'll be face to face, and we'll be a one on one ma match, and then you know we get in this whole thing. However, in the process of that though. Ayato sort of hears about this from Claudia. Claudia gives him his purple sword, and of course he has to run off to go and save her because things are not are not looking wonderful for Julius at the moment. Pretty much leaving everything up to um uh, the recap so far because that's pretty much what happens. And honestly, it's all pretty interesting so far. So yeah, please tell me what you think about this down in the comment section. I'll catch you guys on the next John Grave show. Please keep watching anime, keep playing video games. I'm out.